looking into this for us. Lydan, this would not completely take away the citizen's right to speak, but any little bit of encroachment upon our right to speak makes people nervous. Yeah, some people have a real problem with it, Merle. City Council members tell me that they are considering getting rid of that two minutes you get to speak at the end of City Council meetings. Now, that doesn't mean you don't get to speak at all. The public could still address the council as long as the item is on the agenda. It's just the two minutes at the end of the City Council meetings we're talking about. Now, some City Council members say that this will give public comment a little bit more structure, but other people are concerned it's limiting freedom of speech. Councilman uh, Edmund Ford Jr. chose to use my name. Call my name out. Did you have a problem with me saying your name? You started it. Memphis City Councilman Berlin Boyd tells me it's exchanges like these that have City Council thinking twice about allowing public comments at City Council. When it starts getting to become a personal shouting match uh, with people pointing out individual council members, I think we should act accordingly as it pertains to those incidents. But others on council aren't so quick to agree. We are a government of the people, by the people, and for the people. And why would we silence what those who elected us? Why would we try to silence what they have to say? And citizens have taken to Facebook to voice their opinion on the matter, posting pictures like these in protest. You want to say that I don't deserve a right to express my opinions to the elected officials in this city? That's a slap in the face. Councilman Boyd tells me the measure wouldn't take away the right to speak on the issues. Just the two minutes each citizen has at the end of the meeting. It's just, it just has become a completely like personal vendetta against someone they want to come and rat and rave and use it as a bully pulpit. It's important and if it's important to them it certainly should be important to us. A committee is getting ready to meet sometime next week to discuss the issue. After that it could become an item on the next city council agenda. Reporting live tonight downtown, Lynn Ann Wynn, Fox 13 News.